All right, we are live. Whoops. I'm just trying to fix things up a little bit. All right, so we're live, it looks like. And, all right, I think I am good to go. Let me just bring it up on my computer so I will be able to see the chat. So we're gonna be looking at some more coloring book flip throughs like usual. Okay. Okay. I might as well just show this book because this is what we'll flip through first. And my internet's being a little bit slow today, so I don't know how good a reception we're going to get. I'm just trying to bring up the chat here on my, on my computer so we can see what we're doing. And this I don't need. I don't need to be dealing with notifications right about now. Oh, let's see. Just give me a minute. Okay, here we go. Okay, let me crank down this volume just a little bit on my end. That way we don't get double feedback. Let's see. Oh, Melody's here. Hey, Melody, how are you? So on my live streams, we just um, pretty much do uh, coloring book flip throughs. Uh, I don't really color on my live streams because with my bad eyesight, it's kind of hard for me to do, you know, color on my live stream. So I'm just adjusting my camera just a tad so we can see what we're doing a little bit. I'm going to zoom in just a little bit, hopefully. All right. Uh, sorry, don't mean to make everybody seasick. <laughs> um, sorry for any background stuff that there may be. I've got books kind of sitting here. Okay, who else is here? So, uh, we have Tracy. Hi, Tracy. How are you? Uh, I'm doing good here, Melody. Um, it's been hot, 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 hot. I'm telling you, it has been just super hot and humid. It's been just absolutely nuts. So, we'll see if there's going to be any more folks that are going to be showing up. And then we'll get started with our flip through. So the first one that we are actually going to be looking at is this, um, is this Prima Princesses. This is kind of a unique book because um, it's on watercolor paper, which you don't see too often. Oh, I'm good, Tracy. It's just been really, really humid. Very, very humid and hot. And uh, But thank goodness for central air. <laughs> we, can, we can deal with it as long as we don't have to go outside. Yep. Yeah, I know. I, I know. It seems like everybody's getting a heat wave. Like, this summer's been really tough. This summer's really been tough. I'm not going to lie. Um, Is the picture clear? Is it kind of blurry? My internet's been slow lately. I don't know why. Um, I complained to AT&T one time, and it seemed to be okay for a couple of days, and then it's slowing down again, so I don't know what's going on. All right, good, the picture is clear. Well, why don't we go ahead and get started, ladies, and we'll see if anybody else joins us. Um, okay, good, good. Um, hey, Robin, how are you? So, like always, we're gonna be doing some coloring book flips, and the first one we're gonna be looking at is this Prima Princesses, which is on watercolor paper. This is a coloring book from Prima Marketing. Oh, good, good, I'm, I'm glad. I'm glad it's good. 
So we'll see if a few more people join us, but um, we're gonna look at some. Uh, we're gonna we can go ahead and get started with this with this flip through. I'm doing good here, Robin. It's just been like I was saying to the other ladies. It's been very very humid here, so we've been sitting here with the air conditioning on for the for days and days, which I don't mind a bit <laughs> as long as I don't have to go outside. Okay, so. Yeah, we might, we might as well just go ahead and get the show on the road, huh? All right, so this is um, Prima Princesses. This is book one. And my understanding is that they have several of these out now. Um, I have books one and two, but I think they may have a couple of others. I'm going to be looking into that because I think these pictures are really pretty. So this is a book that's from and it is on watercolor paper. So you can use your watercolor pencils and, um, and color this. You can... Take out the pictures if you want to and frame them. Hey, Victoria, how are you? So, Victoria, what we're going to be doing today, like usual on my streams, is we're going to be looking at coloring book flip throughs, and we're starting out with Prima Princesses Volume 1, which is, this is a book that is on watercolor paper. So you can actually take these out if you want to and color them in, but this is a great way to practice like your skin tones if you want to color people. Hey, Gabrielle, how are you? Um, oh my gosh, thank you so much, Gabrielle. Thank you so much. So, um, Gabrielle, what we're doing today is usually on my streams, we do coloring book flips and we're looking at Prima Princesses Volume 1. This is a book that is on watercolor paper. And so this is a great way to practice like hair and skin and if you like coloring people. I'm so glad you enjoy my streams, Gabrielle. I'm pretty new to this whole streaming thing, but I find that I am addicted. <laughs> I definitely find that I am addicted. I'm gonna turn on a light overhead because I'm, I'm getting some shadowing on the page. So just give me a sec. I should just get in the habit of doing this. I have pretty good lighting in here. Um, usually, like we have skylights in the ceiling, but um, where I'm at, I tend to get some shadows when I'm trying to flip through the book. Sorry, I think that's a, a bit better. Okay. Hey Broncos, how are you? Broncos fan, 96. Okay, well, no question about where your loyalties lie, huh? <laughs> I'm good. I'm good. How are you, Broncos? How are you? How are you, Broncos fan? I'm doing good, just uh, sitting in my central air because it's been, it, outside it's just uh, not fit for man or beast, let me tell you. I know I, I I'm I'm a gosh like I'm I'm so glad you're addicted to watching the flips um oh my gosh yeah too beautiful to paint Tracy says you know what um in a way that is so true like they kind of intimidate me a little bit like I you know what like I have so many books I haven't even colored in yet and I just enjoy just kind of sitting and flipping through the pages hi Lindsay how are you Hey Grace, how are you? Yeah, yeah, this this book is great for watercolor. I mean, it is right on water, watercolor paper, Grace. So it's perfect for watercolors. But you know what? Like I um um I um oh my gosh, what was I saying? Um, going back to Gabrielle's comments about the flips. You know what? Like I love doing these flips on the on the live streams. And to me, it just, um, which, which I'm glad people are enjoying. Like I thought maybe, you know, you folks might find it kind of boring, you know, just watching a flip through of a coloring book for an hour and a half to two hours or something on a stream. But, you know, with my eyesight, this is, you know, except for doing maybe a face to face, this is really about the only thing I can do and be able to halfway <laughs> keep up with the chat kind of decently. So, but I'm, I'm really glad that people are enjoying the flips and, um, I guess it kind of gives you guys some ideas of new books that you might want to get. Oh, 
Oh, okay. Lindsay, you just got done uh, walking your neighbor's English setter. Is it really hot where you are too? Because it's been, it's been just, um, it's, it's been just terrible, you know, with the humidity and stuff here. And, um, I don't like my boys to stay out in it for very long. I let them out to do their business. Um, and then I, you know, I, I don't think it's even, um, you know, there's times I did, I didn't even let them stay out for five minutes. You know, they just kind of did their thing and then they came back in. I figure when they come back up on the porch, you know, it's time that they might want to come in. You know what, Gabrielle? I don't feel so bad. Yeah, I think you're right. We are hoarders of coloring books, aren't we? We are, for sure. Um... Oh, okay. Yeah, Grace, the water, the water, um, the, the watercolor brushes. Yeah, I would imagine. Hey, Debs, how are you? Yeah, Lindsay, um, it's kind of, it's kind of been like, um, off and on overcast today. Like this, it's been kind of off and on with the overcast. Sometimes the sun is out, sometimes not. How are you, Debs? Um, so what we're doing, for those of you that have just joined us, we're doing coloring book flip-throughs, as usual, on my streams. So we're looking at Prima Princesses, Volume 1. This coloring book is from Prima Marketing, and it is printed on watercolor paper, which you don't see very often in a coloring book. Ah, Grace, <laughs> speak for yourselves about being hoarders. Okay, Grace, have you colored a picture in every single one of your coloring books? Let's have true confessions here. How many of you have colored in, how many of you have colored at least one page in all of your coloring books? I haven't. Hey, Dusty, how are you? How are you, Dusty? Um, we're doing good here, Debs. Uh, yeah, we're doing good here, Debs. It's just been, the humidity has been just really high, so we've not really felt like doing a whole lot, you know. We've been just kind of sitting here enjoying our central air. But um, for um, those of you that just came in, we're looking at Prima Princesses, Volume 1. This is printed on watercolor paper. Yep, yep. Hi, Mona. How are you? Yeah, me too, Mona. Like, I'll be the first to admit, I will be such the first to admit that I have so many books I haven't colored in yet. Yep, same here, Debs. Same here, Debs. I have so many I haven't colored in. I could sit there and be shameful of that, but I know for a fact that... Oh my gosh, like I have so many books that to, you know, it would take me a lifetime to color one page in each one. Oh no, oh no, Daryl. Um, well, hi and, and um, bye when you have to go. Um, thunderstorms, oh my gosh, like um, I don't think we're supposed to get any today. Um, I had my computer turned off all day on... Um, Sunday, no, Saturday it was, uh, because we had thunder, like they were predicting thunderstorms all day. So I just turned it off and then we didn't get, we didn't get many of them. Oh, okay. Mona has only three that she hasn't colored in. Well, you're doing a heck of a lot better than me, Mona. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Yeah, you're doing a lot better than me, Mona, because I have so many that I haven't colored in. Oh, Robin's back. Oh, um, a flash flood warning for you, Robin. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay. That's not cool. Yeah, there's no accounting for the weather, is there, sometimes? Robin's just saying hi to everybody. Um, 
That's true, Mona. The, um, how many books do you have? Yeah, I mean, I, I'm guessing I have probably about 450 books. <laughs> ridiculous, isn't it? I mean, just completely ridiculous. It is crazy how quickly things can add up. It is just absolutely crazy how quickly things can add up. I think you're right, Grace, about coloring Queen. I think I think I think she must have like over a thousand books. I think she must have over a thousand books, maybe more. Oh, are you leaving, Grace? Well, you have a good day, and thanks for popping in. Have a good day, Grace. See you later. Um, I think Coloring Queen has, I would, I would guess she's got over a thousand books, Robin. Hey, April, how are you? So what we are doing today, April, is we're doing coloring book flips as per usual on my streams. And so I am, um, we're looking at Prima Princesses Volume 1, which is printed on watercolor paper. It is from Prima Marketing. Yeah, I know, Robin, right? Yeah. Yeah, I, I think that girl has over a thousand books. We're talking about Coloring Queen. I, I think I think she must. Because I think I think she gets okay, we're at the end of this book. I think she gets a lot, a lot of books. Maybe um I, I think she probably may even get some that people send her for review. Would be my guess. Okay, so now we have Prima Princesses Volume Two. I'm thinking that there are several of these books out, but I've got the I've got the first two volumes of this. There may be three and four. I'm gonna have to look. Okay, Mona has only about 25 books. Um, oh my gosh. Uh, oh my gosh, Deb, it's buffering. Um. I'm trying to see if it's buffering here on my computer. Um, so far, on my camera, I think we're still going. So, so yeah, so far on my camera, we're still going. Um, I'm going to move. Let's see. All right, I think we're good. I'm going to just zoom out just a, a little bit. Whoops. Sorry for my fingers getting in the way. I'm just going to zoom out just a little bit because I don't know if we had everything. And I think we might have clipped a little bit off Um in the first book so I'm just gonna zoom I just zoomed out just a little bit um, just trying to look at the comments here oh yeah Robin um, getting a whole punch and fancy them up cool cool okay April has 20, uh, 17 books um, you know what, Debs, you're probably right because sometimes the heat can, can play havoc with my internet and, and uh, you know, maybe that's the same way with all of you guys too because if you're getting storms and floods and stuff, you know. Um, oh my gosh. <laughs> Gabrielle, oh my gosh, that is funny. <laughs> Lindsay has maybe 30 books. Um, and hasn't colored them all yet. Yeah, Gabrielle, uh, you started it, didn't you? Okay, Robin has almost 170 coloring books. Hey, Di, how are you? Okay, Lindsay just started in January. Oh, I was okay zoomed in? Okay, um, you want me to zoom back in? Okay, it was okay zoomed in? Okay, that's good. Um, uh, let's see, bought books in the beginning, um, yeah, you know what, Di, um, you got some in the beginning that you wouldn't get now, um, oh, 
Am I too far away now? All right, let me zoom in again then. Okay, let me just, let me zoom in just a little bit then. Okay, is that a little better? Not quite where I was last time, but hopefully that's a little bit better. Okay, um, is this better? I zoomed back in just a little bit, so let's hope that this is a little bit better. Okay, so, all right, good, 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 all right. So, uh, Victoria, um, okay, Victoria has uh, about 30 physical books, but a lot of PDFs. Um, you know what, like, I have a few PDFs, but most of mine are physical. Okay, good, good, I'm glad this is a little bit better, that's good. That's good, good, good to know. Um, yeah, it's it's kind of crazy, isn't it? Like, um, if a lot of times, like on Etsy, like if, if the PDF book is available, I'll get that uh, rather than um, rather than the physical book because it's so expensive to ship, you know, especially if it's an overseas book. So I'll get a PDF that way. And I think if you get a Jade Summer book, like if you get a physical copy, I think you can get the free, the PDF version of it for free. Okay. Okay, so just looking at the comments here. Um... Yeah, from the grocery store, just not as nice as some uh, better known artists. They were they were good to practice on. That's so true, Die. Like you know what? Like I have many books that now that I wouldn't have. Got, I I have many books that I got in the beginning that I wouldn't get now. Mm hmm. Yeah, gave uh, gave some to the grands. Yeah, that's cool. I'm thinking I have a few that I might donate to our library because like we have a, there, there's a, 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 um, every once in a while, like they'll, they'll have a coloring day up there. So I'm thinking I might give, uh, some to the library. Okay. So this is Prima Princesses volume two. You know, I'm going to refresh my screen just a little bit because not on the phone, but on my computer, because I feel like I am um, running really slow over here. So just give me a sec. Let me refresh the chat. Let me just refresh this a little bit. Okay. I feel like things were coming in slow. Okay, so... Um, Um, yeah, Robin says that, um, Robin says that she'd buy more PDFs if the ink, if, if the ink was better in her printer, um, it's laser, but, but, uh, but it's the gen generic ink, but the generic ink stinks. Yeah. Yeah, Robin. You know what? Sometimes the ink does make a big difference, doesn't it? Yeah, I know, right, Mona? I totally agree. I totally agree. Uh, yeah, senior live. Yeah, senior living places are good too. Die. I totally agree. Hey, Tanfully, how are you? Hi, Tanfully. So what we are doing, Tanfully, is, um, hey, Stella, how are you? Oh, Stella has 167 coloring books and around 12 PDF coloring books. Um, she likes to collect coloring books from different countries. Yeah, that's pretty, yeah. You know what, it's, it's really interesting to see what other country has, you know, for coloring books. Yeah, you know, Robin, um... The ink really does make a big difference. So what we are doing, Tanfully and Stella, um, we're looking at um, coloring book flips, and this is Prima Princesses Volume 2. I flipped through Volume 1, so if you want to 
um, later on, like when, when the stream is over, if you like, you can go back to the beginning and, um, and check that out if you want to. But these books are printed on watercolor paper. These books are from Prima Marketing. You can find them on Amazon. I wonder where May is. Yeah, May isn't here today. Uh, yeah, Mona, you know what? Um, I totally agree with with coloring supplies. Yep. Because you know what? I have a ton of coloring supplies. And I have some now that I probably wouldn't have gotten way back in the beginning. But I got like in the beginning and I probably might not have gotten them now. Maybe. I say maybe, but you know, <laughs> there's probably a couple of colored pencil sets that I probably wouldn't have gotten but luckily for that, um, they weren't too much money, so I wasn't out too much. Um, Dai is experimenting with um, with budget friendly in Create Space paper. Um, you know what? Like a lot of the budget friendly pencils will work on Create Space paper die. Um, I have quite a few budget friendly sets that will work on Create Space paper very well. I think the thing with Create Space Paper is you need something with a harder lead. Um, have you tried Super Tips in Create Space Paper too? I know, I know, right? Tanfully, I hear you, and and it seems and it seems like the more you watch on YouTube, the more you want. You know what? Like it's it's a vicious cycle. It really is. It's a vicious cycle. To me, the more you see on YouTube, the more you want. <laughs> my my coloring stuff is kind of outgrowing my living room. Thankfully, thankfully, we are working on my on my craft room. And once that gets done in there, then that'll be my coloring room, my coloring and creative room. Um. Okay, Die hasn't tried super tips on Create Space paper yet. Um, I did, I did one time in a Hannah Lynn book and it kind of bled through a little bit. So you kind of have to not make many passes over it because it will bleed through that paper. Hey, Katrina, Katrina's here. Hi, Katrina. <laughs> My gal Katrina's here. <laughs> um, Oh, Deb said to buy a few open stock Prismas and Polly's first time um, buying them since you got the full sets last year. Uh, yeah, you know what? It's I love it when when the uh, when the pencils are sold open stock. So Katrina, what we're doing today is we're doing more coloring book flips and we're looking at Prima Princesses Volume Two, and this one is from Prima Marketing, and um, I did Volume One a little bit ago, and this is printed on watercolor paper. Um, oh, Robin, uh, Robin stepped away to, to stir the jambalaya. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Um, yeah, I know, I know, I totally agree, Stella. <laughs> um, Oh, um, Robin, you have the, the fabric castell classics. You know what? Mine just came in. Um, mine just came in a few days ago. So did anybody take advantage of prime day on, uh, on Amazon? Has anybody taken advantage of prime day? I haven't seen any coloring deals though. Um, yeah, Robin. Oh my gosh. And, and that's something I think you got to cook kind of slowly. Like, um, are you cooking it in a crock pot? I bet it's going to be really good. Um, yeah. So did anybody find anything good on for prime day? I think it's still going on. Prime day is still going on. Um, okay. Yeah. Crayolas work very well on create space paper. Yeah, I know, I know, right, Mona? Um, I didn't find any coloring deals on Amazon. Um, oh, um, April says, watching the deals now. You got some combos this morning? 
Um, oh, they were on lightning. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh man, Robin, you are making me hungry. Oh my gosh. She says in about an hour, she's going to add the rice and the shrimp. Oh my gosh. I'm like starving now. <laughs> Yeah, I know Katrina. Um, it seems like it seems like it was more clothing and a lot of electronics were um were doing the the prime deal yesterday. I actually got, um, I actually did take advantage of um, a um, I wanted to get the uh, Amazon Eco, and so normally like the big one sells for like ninety nine bucks. They had a they had a, a two pack deal yesterday. It was a lightning deal. And so I got two of them for like 119 bucks. So one's going to go in my living room and one's going to go in my bedroom. Oh, what, what did, uh, let's see, April. Oh yeah. April. Let's see. Um, yeah. April just said she got some Tombos. Yeah, I know. Right. Robin. Um, were they the Tombow or Rogitans, April? Oh, uh, Mona says, uh, she saw the, the instant pot six quart. Oh, is it, is it still on, is it still on sale, Mona? Um, okay. Stella says the Tombos bleed through the pages and the coloring books. Um, I wanted to try them. Uh, oh, she's asking if the Tombos bleed through. Um, are you, well, the, if, are you talking about the zigs or, or, or the, the, the Tombow markers, you know, that are kind of like the zigs or, or um, I guess I was thinking that April got the uh, Tombow Rogitin colored pencils. Um, I don't know about the Tombow markers. I don't have them. I can't answer that. Hey, Alicia, how are you? Oh, okay. The Tombow markers. Um, so yeah, April, uh, Stella was asking if they bleed through the, uh, the paper and the coloring books. I don't know. I can't answer that because I don't have them. Yeah. Um, yeah, I've had my eye on, on, on the instant pot. I I've had my eye on it myself. Um, oh, what about the ink tense blocks? Oh, uh, you know what? Oh my gosh. Like I don't have the ink tense blocks. I've never even tried them. I know that they're kind of like, Hey Donna, how are you? Donna's joined us today. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I, I, um, what was I saying? Uh, yeah, I don't have the, um, oh my gosh, a $50 savings Mona. Um, yeah, I don't have the ink tense blocks. I imagine that they were kind of like the, uh, the, the pencils, right? Uh, yeah, I think it probably does depend on the paper. Yeah, I think the paper has a lot to do with it. Okay, Robin doesn't get bleed through with, with brush markers. I, you know what? I think it does depend on the paper. Um, okay. Um, Tanfully is saying you don't have to be a prime member to take advantage of the deal. Um, so, okay. Die has the blocks you can use right from the stick and add, and add uh, color, uh, to color to the page. Use a water brush. Yeah. Um, yeah, I, I thought that was how it worked because it was just the pure pigments or whatever in the blocks. Yeah, I'm going to be checking out that, that deal for that Instant Pot. Okay, this is the end of this book. I'm definitely going to be checking out that deal for the Instant Pot. I'm telling you right now. I'm telling you right now. So let's find us another book to look at. How about we look at... Um, Okay, so this is a little coloring book I picked up. It is called The World of Fairies, and this is by Sarah Burrier. I believe I picked this one up on Amazon. Yeah, same color palette as the pencils. Yeah, I think it's just, 
it's the same stuff. It's just in the block form, I would imagine. Um, more bookmarks, Robin says. Uh, yeah, Robin says, let's see, um, Katrina hasn't tried the blocks out yet. You have to tell me how you like them, Katrina. Um, Robin's asking if I put inks in the, in the books. Oh, um, yeah, I can, yeah, I will put links in the description, Robin, like once the stream is over with, I will, I'll make a note of what books that I flip through and I will put links in the description. I didn't do it last time, but I can start doing that because I think it's, it, it would be kind of helpful. Um... Oh, Tanfully says, uh, the deal, her deal was, uh, was five bucks off of, off of coloring books. I think don't you have to get like $25 worth of books or something to get the, the five bucks or something like that. Um, oh, I'm good here, Donna. Just, it's been, we've had a heat wave here and the humidity is so high. So we've been just, we've had our air conditioning on for days and days, um, Okay, Donna says it'll bleed through um, thin paper, but not on better paper. Yeah, I, I gathered as much. Now, this book is printed on Create Space paper that I'm flipping through now. This is World of Fairies by Sarah Burrier. Um, okay, <laughs> Robin says she's being lazy and not jotting down the ones that she likes. So this page uh, looks like it has some tips on coloring. Let me just make sure. Um, yeah, this is some coloring tips that, that the artist offers. So I can leave this page up for just a minute and you guys can make a little note of that if you want to. Sometimes the artist will offer some coloring tips. Yeah, yeah, Katrina, I'll, I'll be uh, looking forward to hearing what you think about them. Oh, okay. Yeah. If, um, okay. So Tanfully says, yeah, only 20 with the price of books. If you get two, you can, you can get it on Amazon. Okay. I'll look, I'll look at that. I'll look at that. Hey, Kenneth, how are you? How are you doing today, Kenneth? So we're doing some coloring book flips and I did, um, I'll put in the description section, the, the, names and the links but we did prima princesses volume one and two which is printed on watercolor paper now we are looking at world of fairies by sarah burrier this is on uh, create space paper oh uh, let's see Oh, we're, we're having your Florida weather, Donna. <laughs> you know what? We will definitely take your Florida weather when it, when, uh, when it comes winter. Um, yeah, I will definitely take your Florida weather then. <laughs> um, oh, let's see. Katrina says, uh, something about glad they got the book share um and I, and I was wondering how did it look oh you mean you mean this book here Katrina um so Kenneth is talking about her puppy his puppy oh yeah what is what is her name Kenneth and how long have you had her? Yeah, what, what's your puppy's name and how long have you had her, Kenneth? So this book, it looks like it's got some pretty good details in it if you like intricate. Um, oh, okay, her name is Sophie. Sophie Beatrice. Uh, Sophie Beatrice Rue for the Golden Girls. Aw, how cute. I love that show. 
You know, they don't make TV shows like that anymore. They don't make TV shows like they used to. TV isn't what it used to be. Oh, you had her up for only for only two days, Kenneth. Aw. And she's ten weeks old. Aw. Aw. Cute. What kind is she, Kenneth? Like, what breed is she? Oh, okay, yeah, um, okay, Katrina, um, okay, okay, I, yeah, you were glad I got this book, um, I don't know if I've ever seen a flip through of this book before, actually, I'm trying to think, I'm trying to think how I even heard of this book, did you make me get this one, Katrina? <laughs> Was this another one you made me get? Um, Stella has a Boston Terrier, Arthur, um, Howard and Stanley, um, yeah, Sophie Beatrice is such a cute name, isn't it? Oh, okay, a Yorkie Poo, aw. I bet she's a cutie, I bet she's a cutie. Um, I missed something. Let's see. Donna says, um, oh, Donna got the color at pencils. Um, they're so nice. You know what? I've heard some mixed, I've heard some mixed opinions about the color at pencils. I don't have them, so I can't really say, but I've heard some mixed, um, oh, hey, Stephanie. Um, I've heard some mixed reviews about the, um, about the, the color at pencils. Stephanie sent me a super chat. Hi, Stephanie. She sent me a super chat. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much, Stephanie. <laughs> um, Katrina says she has colored pencils. Um, not so bad, but you do have to sharpen them quite often. And that makes them go out really quickly. She said she'd never buy them again. Yeah, thank you so much, Stephanie. <laughs> How are you doing today, Stephanie? Yeah, um... Yeah, I've heard a lot of mixed reviews about those color at pencils. And if you have to sharpen them a lot, it kind of defeats the purpose. And I don't think they're sold open stock either, are they? You can't get them open stock, right? So what we're doing, Stephanie, is some more coloring book flips. And this is a World of Fairies by Sarah Burrier. This is printed on Create Space Paper. Oh, Katrina says, no, she didn't make me get this book. <laughs> heard about this book to be honest yeah um yeah colorful life definitely doesn't like them um yeah um yeah I know she hated them I know she hated them Stephanie Yeah, it is hard to keep up with everyone, isn't it? Oh my gosh, it's very, very hard to keep up with everybody. Yeah, the uh, the Yorkie Poo sounds so cute. Uh, oh, I bet she's adorable, Kenneth. Yeah, I, I bet I bet she has a lot of energy, doesn't she, Kenneth? I bet she must have a lot of energy. but the perfect lap dog. <laughs> oh, uh, Kenneth, this is, um, this is World of Fairies by Sarah Burrier. And this is, this is on Create Space Paper. Um, let's see, Katrina, let's see. Katrina says the pencils are good, but they, 
uh, they have good pigmentation, but you have to sharpen them kind of often. Um, they run out fast. Uh, she said she'd never buy them again. Oh, hey, no problem, Victoria. Oh my gosh, you had to get your cat down from the entertainment center. Oh my gosh, you got, oh my gosh, you got stuck behind the TV. Oh my gosh, that could, that, that could have been a real, yeah, that, that could have been a, that, that could have been a interesting little predicament there. <laughs> yeah. Hey Holly, how are you? And just. Trying to keep up with the comments here. Yeah, you know, that's that's so true, Donna. You don't know until you try different pencils. Yeah, oh my gosh, Victoria. <laughs> um. Oh, um. Kenneth says that, that his dog is really mellow. Let me scroll back up so I can see this. Kenneth says that his dog is really mellow, but um, his mom has her sister, and she said she got uh, an extra shot of energy that <laughs> kept her up all night. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Just like a little baby, huh? Oh, Victoria got her cat down. <laughs> Victoria says her cat is crazy. Oh, Robin's working on her blog. That's cool. <laughs> um, okay, Katrina says you can't get the color at pencils in open stock. Uh, Dye says it comes down to pencil paper and your and your tech technique. Yeah, not a one size fits all. That is that is so for sure, Dye. That's so for sure. Oh. Hi, Ollie. How are you? Ollie says he's just discovered YouTube. So just uh, looking at the comments here, just it, it gets hard to keep up with you guys. I'm telling you. <laughs> um, oh, Katrina said that that some of them were broken. So you had to put them through the electric sharpener. Oh, my gosh. Oh, that's that's not cool. That is not cool. Um, this is this is uh, World of Fairies by Sarah Burrier. This is World of Fairies by Sarah Burrier. Um, I'm glad your cat is okay, Victoria, because that that could have been a real that could have been a real problem. Um. <laughs> your mom wants to trade dogs <laughs> and Kenneth says no I don't blame you Kenneth I don't blame you Kenneth not at all um yeah Ollie just feel free to jump right in you know the chat is going kind of quickly just jump right on in you know That's true, Di. Like, Kenneth could be in a honeymoon period. You never know. You never know. But fingers crossed that she'll stay very mellow, right? Um. Okay. <laughs> Holly says the book is in her Amazon cart. Hey, you're welcome, Holly. Always glad to help enable, right? <laughs> hey, you're, yeah, you're, you're welcome, Victoria. What I'm gonna try to do after the stream is over is is I'm making I'm keeping an I'm making kind of mental notes about what books I flip through and I'll put links in the description so everybody can get them after the stream. May is not here to give us links. I don't know where May is today. I hope she's okay. It's not like her to miss a stream, but I understand that sometimes people have other stuff they gotta do. Yeah, Robin's making jambalaya, everybody. <laughs> Holly and Ollie. <laughs> yep, yep. Go for the rhymes, right? <laughs> um, yep, Holly and Ollie. Um, 
Kenneth's dog, his name is uh, Sophie, Sophie, Sophie Beatrice, right? I think, I think that's what you said, right, Kenneth? So this was World of Fairies by Sarah Burrier. Let's see what else we got here. And my phone is plugged in today, so we shouldn't have a problem with like, um, with a, with the uh, batteries going dead. Okay, so this is kind of a different book. This is Elegant, um, Elegant Escapes, and this is put out by Crayola. Um, they've made several of these books, and this is quite different. So it's got a little bit of everything in this. So I thought I would go ahead and show this book. Um, let me just twirl around here so we can hopefully see a little bit better. Okay, so um, this is um, this is Elegant Escapes by Crayola, and this is kind of a thick book. This has got a little bit of everything in it, and I don't know if there's been many flip-throughs of these kinds of books, so I thought I would go ahead and do one here. Whoa, just made myself seasick there. I'm, I'm looking at the video from my computer screen, too, not my phone, so I can keep up with the chat, and... Um, when I moved the camera, it just kind of went, it, it went really wonky. <laughs> um, uh, oh, hey, no problem, Robin. Yeah, May, uh, May, she's usually on the ball with giving links. Yeah, it's, it's no problem. What I can do, um, what I can also do after the stream is I will, um, put links in the description section so people coming over here to watch it, they can get that. Okay, Sophie Beatrice Rue after the Golden Girls. Awesome. I just forgot about the Rue part. Aw, Di says she slept on the floor with the puppy more than once. Yeah, I know, right? Oh, okay, Katrina says she likes this book. That's cool. Yeah, I don't think there's many flip throughs of, of these books on here, you know, on YouTube. So um, this is a rather thick book, this Crayola one. Yeah, Kenneth. Um, yeah, it sounds like you got a real keeper, huh? Yeah, I didn't think so, Tanfully. I didn't think there was a lot of flip throughs of, of this book. But there's there's a little bit of everything in here. Okay, there we go. Um, okay, Robin put up a link for the fairies book. So I don't know exactly how many pages there are in this book, but it is single-sided. And uh, it's single-sided, and it's, it's pretty decent paper. So some of these look a little, some of these look quite a lot harder than others. Oh, Katrina doesn't eat pork. Um, and then uh, Robin put up one for the Elegant Escapes book that we're looking at now. Thanks, Robin. Um, so has any so it, has anybody had anything funny happen to them lately? We need a good laugh today. <laughs> yes, um, I agree, Die. A very good variety of picks in this book. <laughs> uh, um, um, okay, so Stella is adjusting to her a little bit get it you know they'll get it together oh the 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 prima yeah the prima coloring books have the best paper um i know right um the yeah the prima books um the prima books do have the best paper that that's actually watercolor paper that is that that's actual watercolor paper it'd be kind of nice if it if um books had better paper if other books had better paper. Um, I'm not sure how many pages there are in this one. There's got to be at least 50. 
I mean, I'll, I'll show you how thick this book is. Let me show you how thick this book is. Oh, yeah, there's, there's how thick this book is. So I imagine there's got to be at least um, 50 pages in this book. Um, I'm trying to think. Let me see if it has anything on the front that says how many. Um, from the RLC. Yeah, it doesn't say how many books. Or, oh, it says uh, it says 80 unique pages from, uh, let's see, 80 unique pages for coloring. Right there on the front, it says 80 unique pages for coloring. So I was right. There was at least 50. But yeah, there's 80 pages to color. Oh my gosh. Um, <laughs> Di says she asked Shalene to sing on her, on her live stream. Um, she replied that she would... Um, and sounded good. I, I thought of you. Oh, I didn't know Shalene could sing. Um, funny is that lately during streams, uh, when I am going on my laptop, uh, the cat, the cat comes and lays on my hands and the keyboard. <laughs> yeah, cats are good at that, right? Um, oh, um, Deb says she's ticked off, got builders... For the bathroom and kitchen uh we're supposed to finish last friday then it changed to tomorrow now it's this friday oh how frustrating yeah um kenneth likes it when there's blank page on the opposite side you can use different you can use different um mediums i totally agree i totally agree um oh my gosh talk about men in kilts again <laughs> <laughs> oh katrina likes it when when both when um when i guess I have a design on it she says she gets her money's worth that way <laughs> um oh my gosh um she would make Anne sound goody. You are the only one that can sing. Oh my gosh. 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 <laughs> Di was talking about Shalene. Oh my gosh. Anybody that would make Anne sound good. Oh my goodness. Goodness me. Because you know Anne, she, you know, you know Anne and her karaoke. <laughs> um. Oh, um, Robin, Robin would have linked the, the Prima books on Amazon, but she couldn't find them on Amazon. Um, there are several on Amazon. Um, yeah, the two were called Prima Princesses, um, and the one was Prima Princesses and the other was Prima Princesses Volume 2. Yeah. It's called Prima Princess Book 1 and, and Prima Princess Book 2. Oh, Thomas Kincaid. Yeah, I, I don't have his book, but I would love to have his book. Oh, Kenneth. Uh, oh, my gosh. <laughs> he says he might have to slowly backwards exit. No, no, don't go. Don't go. <laughs> oh, yeah, I, I bet Shaleen was really funny. Raven, Linda Ravenscroft has, has a superb water paper. Oh, that's awesome, Katrina. I, I don't have her books either. Um, yeah, I, I don't have any of her books, but, um, I'm going to make a note to add them to my wish list. Oh, bye, Lindsay. Bye, Lindsay. Have a good day. Um, oh, Kenneth was doing a watercolor picture and the, and the brush wanted to keep leaking, leaking. Oh, no, Kenneth. That's, oh, my gosh. 
Okay, so Robin put a link up to one of the princess books. Bye, Lindsay. Have a good day. Thanks for joining us. Oh, man, I'm sorry to hear that, Kenneth. That's awful. <laughs> Kenneth. <laughs> are you kidding about us being wonderful, or are you kidding about staying? Ah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Oh, man. Okay, Robin uh, found the link to the other princess book. Thanks, Robin. So my phone is plugged into the computer, so we shouldn't have battery issues, which is great. Because if you guys remember last time I was streaming and I had to quit because my battery went dead. We still had a good stream anyway. We got like about an hour and a half in. These pages are perforated in this book. Oh, good. Oh, oh, I'm glad you're staying. Can yeah, we have a good time. We really have a good time. Uh, sorry to hear about your picture, though, man. That sucks. So this book has perforated pages, so you can actually take them out of the book. Um. Oh my gosh, Katrina. <laughs> I've had so many people tell me my laugh is very infectious. Who thinks I had to give a burst of song, huh? <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, there's there's some really good pages in here, aren't there, Ollie? Yeah, some of them some of them are very detailed. Hey, Coloraroo, how are you? How are you, Coloraroo? So we're doing some coloring book flips and we're looking at the elegant escapes by Crayola. Hey, we miss your Walmart stories. <laughs> ah, beep, beep songs. <laughs> ah, beep, beep. Yep, Mona says beep, beep. Okay, um, what, what song do we want to beep, beep today? Um, <coughs> um, hmm, let me think here. Um, hmm. Hey, Sept hey, September, how are you? How's it going? Oh, no trouble from you today, color a real. Aw, what are you sick or something? <laughs> yeah, oh my gosh, last week it was crazy. It was so crazy. Um, okay, trying to figure out what I'm gonna sing today. Um how about Hmm. Boy, I'm at a I'm at a loss here. Yes, lots of laughs for sure. Definitely lots of laughs die. Okay. So here we go. Let me let me think here. Um I had something in my head, but Trying to figure out what I'm going to sing. Yeah, some brushes do leak a lot. I agree, Di. Um, have you tried the Zig Detailer, Kenneth? That's a really good water brush. Uh, 
um, True Colors. I have to I have to look at the lyrics on that one. I don't remember all the lyrics on that one. I'll make a note of that and I'll 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 make a note of that and look at the lyrics for next time. That way I can sing that one. Boy, it's been years since I've heard that song. It's been years and years. Yeah, Kenneth, um, you might want to try the Zig Detailer because that one, like, I've never had any issues with leaking on that one. And that one does a nice job. Katrina wants to know what's going on. Um, hmm. Yeah, the, yeah, I totally agree, Robin. The Zig water brushes are nice. Um, uh, yeah, Stella says she hates when that happens. Uh, Pentel water, bru Pentel water brushes are good. Yeah, those are pretty good, too. I think my favorite still has to be the Zig. Um, just keeping up with the comments here. Oh, um. Just disappointed on Prime Day, Ollie, um, because like no coloring stuff was was uh, was on was on deal. Yeah, if if that's the case, I totally agree. Oh, the Zig the Zig water brush is on sale on Amazon for four twenty for four for four thirty two tanfully. Um, I think when I got mine, it was like five bucks. Uh, yes, 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 yes. I totally agree, Color Aru. I wish Prismas were on sale, too. I'm surprised that they weren't. I'm actually very, very shocked that they weren't. And did you see they went all the way back up to 120 bucks for the 150 set? Yeah, I was disappointed in that. I know, I know. Yeah, I know, right, Katrina? Um, I was very surprised that that not that that uh, no coloring stuff was on sale for Prime Day. Oh, okay. There's Robin put up a link for the water brush for Kenneth. Oh, okay. Um, Ollie saw Arteza water brushes for twenty nine dollars. Yeah, I know all. You know what I think? I think Prime Day was. Um, I think it was mostly clothing and electronics. Okay, Blick sometimes has good prices on the Prismas. Um, uh, Stella says. I know. I know. I know. Like. Um, I know Coloraru, like they're back, they're all the way back up to 120 and, and they were around $90 before. I've seen them all the way down to like uh, 85. Um, yeah, September, we're just flipping through some coloring books. Um, right now we're looking at the Elegant Escapes from Crayola. Um, but Prime Day, yeah, you really didn't miss anything because it was mostly electronics and clothing. Now, if you wanted like a, a one an, an Amazon Alexa speaker, they were uh, that was an awesome deal for that. 
Yeah, Prime Day wasn't any good for colorists. I totally agree. Oh, okay. I know what to sing. Um, Stephanie, a, a while back ago, requested Amazing Grace. So we can, we'll, we'll do some Amazing Grace. Um, I'm going to have to go beep beep in the middle of it, though, because of the, the those bots. <clears throat> okay. Amazing Grace, how sweet the sound. Beep beep. <laughs> that saved a wretch like me. Beep beep. I once was lost, but now I'm found. Was blind, but now I see. There you go, Steph. I hope you liked it. Yes, it was very good for electronics, Katrina. Um, yes, uh, more reason to get the Black Widow. Yep. Uh, they are definitely are a must-have. Oh, Robin got her Artezas on Saturday. <laughs> Thank you, Coloru. <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh no, Robin, you were buffering while I was singing. Oh, thank you, Stephanie. Thank you, Debs. Thank you all so much. Oh, thank you, Tanfully. Thank you so much. Oh no. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no, Ollie! You you were buffering. It says, uh, let's see. Uh, while you were singing, the computer was buffering, and I'm laughing and singing with you like a hyena. Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh, thank you, Kenneth. Huh? Don't tell don't tell me I'm done. You want me to sing more, Robin? I can do it again. I can do it again since we were buffering. Thank you. Thank you so much, Kenneth. I can do it again since you guys were buffering. That's not a problem. All right, here we go. Let's Amazing Grace take two. <laughs> Amazing Grace, how sweet the sound. Beep, beep. <clears throat> I have to do that because of the bots. <laughs> That saved a wretch like me. Beep, beep. <laughs> I once was lost, but now am found. Was blind. Shall we do another verse? Hopefully it wasn't buffering this time. Oh, thank you so much, Debs. Thank you. Okay, um, so let's do another verse. Robin wants another verse. <clears throat> when we Beep, beep. Bright shining as the sun. Beep, beep. <clears throat>
there we go. Oh no, oh no, Ollie, something's wrong with your computer. Oh, it was buffering. Sorry, guys. Oh my God. Thanks so much, Robin. Aw, thank you so much, Robin. Thank you so much, Debs. Oh, good, good. Tanfully wasn't buffering. That's awesome. That's awesome. That's awesome. Oh, good. Oh, good, Ollie. I'm glad you got to hear some of it anyway. Thank you so much, Debs. Thank you. Thank you, Coloraru. Thank you, everyone. Oh, my gosh. Thank you so much, Stella. Thanks, Mona. Oh, you're welcome, Katrina. Anytime. But, yeah, Steph had requested that uh, quite a while back ago, and I told her I would do it, so... There it is. Oh, good. Oh, good. Katrina wasn't buffering. That's good. That's good. You're so welcome, Mona. I'm glad you all enjoyed it so much. Thank you. Yes, Robin. I, I totally agree about the Arteezes. I love mine. I love mine. Oh, thank you so much, Tanfully. Oh, thank you, Katrina. Oh my gosh, Gabrielle says I should go on a talent show. You know what? I tried out for America's Got Talent, but um, it never happened. Yeah, I totally agree about the Arteezes. I love mine. Yeah, I tried out for America's Got Talent, you guys, but it never happened. I do some professional singing, like, around here, but, um, you know, when I was, when I was, like, a teenager and younger, like, I, I had big dreams about becoming, like, this world-famous singer, but it never happened. Never happened. Robin says to try again. Yeah, you know, um, I will. Maybe get a, uh, maybe do it on some better recording equipment this time and see how that goes. Um, yeah, Robin says now to find time to color. I totally agree. You know what, Ollie, I think, you know what, I think you're right because like shows like The Voice and, and America's Got Talent, I think a lot of that stuff is rigged. I think they do it for the ratings, unfortunately. Oh, thank you, Katrina. Thank you so much, Katrina. Um... Oh, Crimson Day by, by Avenged, Avenged Sevenfold, uh, okay, yeah, I'll make a note of that, I'll, I'll make a note of that, Debs, and, um, yeah, I'll make a note of that, Debs, and, uh, I've never heard that one before, um, Crimson Day, okay, I'll make a note of that and look that song up, um, yeah, the Black Widows are awesome, too. And they work very nice on Create Space Paper. What happened? I, I don't know what happened, Katrina. <laughs> um, oh, my, oh, my gosh. Then Ollie says no because then, then I wouldn't be on YouTube. Well, that's true. That's true. Like if, if, if <laughs> Mona says beep, beep. Yeah, you know, if my life had taken that turn, I wouldn't be on YouTube. That's for sure. Oh my gosh, thank you so much, Kenneth. Thank you so much. Um, Katrina, when I tried out, like, no, like, um, I didn't hear a word. I didn't hear a thing. Um, I made a, I made a recording and, um, and send it to him, um, online. You know, follow the directions to send it to him online, but, uh, nobody ever got back to me about anything. So, that was that. 
Oh no, Holly says the wood chipped away on, on Holly, your, your wood chipped away on your black widows as you sharpen them. Oh, may, do you have another, like a different pencil sharpener that you can try? That's true, Katrina. Like if you want something bad enough, never give up on it. That's true. Of course, me being like in my, you know, in my mid forties, I'm not, I'm not a spring chicken no more. Oh, okay. Deb says that that song is one of their ballads and, and she loves it. Yeah, I will look up that song for sure. Oh, thank you, Mona. Um, Victoria says if I was on a talent show on, on TV, um, she said she'd so vote for me. Um, well, thank you so much, Victoria. Thank you. Oh, thank you so much, Mona. Um, Robin's talking about the Black Widows. Yeah, like all all of those sets, like the Black Widows, the Scorpion, and the and the Cobras, they work very very well together. Oh no, Holly's tried all kinds of sharpeners on them. Oh, maybe you got a bad batch. Oh, Color Roo says I can make it on YouTube. Um, I was requested to actually make a singing channel, which I'm going to do. I have a better mic and everything now, so I'll be able to do that. Um, I can't really devote this channel to the, the singing because of the bots, <laughs> but, um, but I will, um, I am going to make a, a singing channel. And once I do that, I will let everybody know so you can come over and watch. Oh no, Victoria's pencils were all broken. Um, and and they and they sharpen down to nothing. It sounds like you guys got a bad batch. Oh, um, Color Roo says many artists are local but make a pretty penny on uh, on YouTube. Um, I am going to be making a singing channel, so uh, we'll see how that goes. I'm not a very good songwriter though. Like I can, I can sing just about anything, but as far as like writing songs, I would, <laughs> I would have to get, I would have to get somebody to write me like new songs. Um, oh, um, Katrina says, uh, I have to sing with, with some soul. Um, and by example, um, a song from Whitney Houston. You know what? Like, I'm not very good at all. Like, <laughs> you know, she does like all those, those vocal gymnastics like Mariah Carey. And that's not my style. That's not my style. Um, yeah, that is really odd about, about the pencils breaking like that. Uh, oh, Holly says they've offered to replace them though. Other than them, them shipping. I, um, other than them chipping. Yeah. It sounds like you guys must've gotten a bad batch or something like that. Um, Oh, Katrina says they were bad for me. That's too bad. Oh, some channels only do cover. Well, that's true. Some channels only do covers. Yeah, that is very true. Color Roo. Okay, I will, um, when I, when I get that channel up and going, I'll certainly let everybody know. I'll make like a video on my, I'll make a video on this channel to announce it. And then you guys can, can, um, oh, <coughs> you guys can come over and subscribe to it. Ollie says, uh, he loves the roses. Yeah, definitely go for the replacements, Holly. Oh, Robin's adding to her jambalaya. Be back in a few. You're still making me hungry, Robin. Um, uh, 
Oh, yeah, Katrina, um, you should get them. They're, they're actually very nice pencils. The Black Widows are actually very, very nice pencils. Um, but I would, I would get all three sets because um, they complement each other very well. When they were made, they were meant to do that. <coughs> so the first one is the Black Widows. The second ones were the Scorpions. And the third ones were the, um, were the, were the Cobras. I totally agree, Ollie. Very yummy, isn't it? Yes. I want some too. I want some jambalaya. <laughs> if I were to make it here, I'd have to make it shrimpless because my husband doesn't like shrimp. So that is the Elegant Escapes from Crayola. Let's see what else that we can find. Let's see. Uh, oh, this is a good one. This is a good one. Um, this is the Inspired Room. And I got this book thanks to the Bibliophile Colorist. Um, let's see. Color Roo says, awesome. Don't let the talent go to waste. Um, you used to sing, but uh, <clears throat> and was, uh, you were trained and, oh no, you strained your voice. Oh no. Oh no. Color Roo, you strained your voice. Oh man. Oh. Um, oh, you got the, you got the pack of very thins for 20 bucks, Dusty. That's awesome. Oh, Ollie, um, Ollie says uh, after the Arteza's uh, gonna get the Black Widows and then and then done, huh? You know what, Ollie? That's what we all say. <laughs> uh. Yes, Katrina. I know you are definitely part of the club. Katrina's talking about the pencil hoe club. Because <laughs> I'm the biggest pencil hoe there is out there. I know, right? Yeah, that's that's terrible about uh, about about some uh, yeah about straining your voice, Colorado. That's terrible. Oh, Holly wants whole binds. Holly wants whole binds. Yeah, Holly, they are awesome pencils. I love my whole binds. Oh man. Yeah, I know, I know, right, Dusty? Like, my husband thinks I'm totally nuts. <clears throat> you know what? Like, I had a, I gotta tell you guys, I had a comment on, on, on one of my videos, and it was, oh gosh, I think I did that video over a year ago, and um, it was when I had first gotten the Luminance colored pencils, and um, so I was, I was showing them, and, and somebody gets on, the, you know, somebody I'd never heard of before, you know, hadn't been subscribed to my channel or anything, Somebody gets on there and says, well, why would you spend all that money on an artist grade pencil just to use in a coloring book? You know, they were just being really ignorant about it. And, um, and I have no patience for that. Right. So I replied back and I said, because I wanted to, you know, why would I spend that much money on an artist grade pencil to color just in a coloring book? Because I wanted to. And I just left it at that. <clears throat> Yeah, I, w I wonder if there's any kind of therapy for, for that kind of thing. That's not my expertise or anything, but um, I don't know if there's any kind of therapy that you can take to, you know, to maybe strengthen your voice again. Yeah, Debs, um, Holbein's our most colorist dream. I Yeah, I know what you mean. I had to save up my nickels for them things. <clears throat> Uh, let's see. What are the requirements to be, what are the requirements to be a pencil hoe? Uh, well, just have several sets of pencils and be very enthusiastic about your pencils and you're a pencil hoe. <laughs> oh.
Yeah, color a roux. You should. You should. You should look into that and see if uh, you know maybe take some training or something to see if you can you know to see if you can get your voice back. Um. Oh, Katrina's listing her pencils here, and yeah, Katrina. <laughs> she wants the Lyra's and um, and Mitsubishi and. I'll be done, I think. Yeah, I want to get the Mitsubishi ones, too. I've seen them on, you, or on YouTube, and I want to get them, too. Yeah, you know what? Holbein's are something you've really got to save up for. I had to. Yes, Ollie, it is like being a coloring book, ho. Absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> um... Yeah, you should, you, I agree with Katrina about your voice color, Roo. Oh, Victoria. Well, you know what? We can, we can teach you how to be a pencil ho. <laughs> um, Oh, uh, you're thinking about getting a coloroo and training on that? That would be awesome. My friend Brenda did that. Like she's, you know, she's always wanted to do something musical. So <clears throat> I want to say about maybe 10 or 15 years ago, she got a, she, she got a clarinet and started training on it. And she does pretty good. She does pretty good. So go for it. Um... Uh, color Roo is more of a coloring book ho. Oh, Robin's back. So Robin, we're just talking about being a pencil ho. Um, I'm flipping through the um, Inspired Room coloring book. And these pages are single-sided and perforated. Yes, you. I totally agree, Katrina. You have to love, love, love your pencils no matter what they are. Um, yeah, um, that'd be awesome if the Holbeins did go down in price, tanfully. So, Robin, we're just talking about being pencil hoes and the requirements to be a pencil ho. <laughs> yeah, I hear you, Ollie. I want some, too. I'm coming to your house for dinner, Robin. Um... Yeah, you know what, Robin? Like, I have, um, I think the only artist grade ones I don't have are the Mitsubishis, and, and I don't, and, uh, oh, and I don't have the Spectrum Noirs either. I don't have those, but I'd like to get those. The only thing with those is you can't get them open stock. Yep, I guess I fall into both of those categories because I'm a pencil hoe and I'm a coloring book hoe, says the girl with 450 plus books, right? <laughs> Yeah, I totally agree. I hope the Holbeins do come down in price. It'd make, it'd make uh, more people able to get them. Oh, Kenneth has uh, good luck and, and good results from everything Crayola. That's awesome. You know what? Crayola's just a good, reliable brand, you know, to be honest. Ooh, Ollie's bringing his sparkling sangria. Oh, I'm going to bring my Chardonnay. I'm, com I'm coming and I'm bringing my Chardonnay. <coughs> um, oh, Robin put the link in for this book. This is the Inspired Room. I got this one thanks to the Bibliophile Colorist. So thanks for putting the link in there, Robin. Um, yeah, Kenneth says he has good luck with the uh, good luck and good results with Crayola. Oops. All right. Sorry, guys. Don't mean to make you seasick. I hit the tripod and had to readjust the the camera. Oh, Color Roo's going to do a Crayola Crayon Challenge. 
I did that. I did that a while back ago. Oh my gosh. Uh, 12 sets of Crayolas are on sale for, for 97 cents at Walmart. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. That's cheap. Um. <laughs> Ollie says, um, Ollie says, um, uh, he doesn't count them, just sneaks them in. That's funny. You, you know what? Me too. Uh, that's true, Katrina. You can get them a little bit at a time on eBay, you know, talking about the whole binds. Um... Oh, Katrina says that she's got the Spectrum Noir and the and the Aqua pencils, and you can buy them in miniature sets. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. Yeah, Coloraroo. That would be awesome if the 100 count of Crayolas did go on sale. That would be awesome, wouldn't it? Um, yeah, the regular Crayolas and the Crayola Escapes are very different. Yeah, Robin. Um, are you or are you talking about the the um? I have the Crayola signature ones, you know, which are which are definitely uh, different from the regular Crayolas. Is that what you're talking about? The ones in the tin and they're black pencils. Yeah, I know, I know, right? That was funny. Me too. Yeah, that was funny <laughs> about sneaking them in. Yeah, it, it's so funny because every time I get a package, my husband goes. More damn coloring books. <laughs> oh. oh, okay. Um, oh, yeah. You know what? I heard that the escapes and the regular Crayola were pretty much the same, just different packaging. That's not true because I don't have the escapes. I don't have the escapes ones. I, just, I thought they were the same as the regular Crayola, but just in different packaging, packaging so that they could get more money for them. Um, Victoria says her, her boyfriend says I need to add on to the house every time she gets new coloring stuff. <laughs> I know, right? That's, that's kind of how I'm feeling. Yeah, um, you know what? You really can't go wrong with Crayola. You really can't. And and they're they're so affordable that <clears throat> you know, they're so affordable and and very reliable. So if if that's you know, the only like if that's the only pencil you ever get is a Crayola pencil, you can you can get the job done very very beautifully. Oh, the the Craze Arts have, have been good too. Um, I've heard some mixed reviews about them like over the years, but they must have changed up the formula or something like that. Um, okay, you, you can buy the Spectrum Noir from Home Shopping Network and make payments. Um, and also do that with the, with the 96 Aqua set that way. That's true, Katrina. You know, I never thought of doing it that way. I've bought things from Home Shopping Network, but never thought to uh, never thought to look for coloring supplies on there. Oh, you can't you can't get the Debs. You can't get the Crayola Escapes in the UK. Oh, that sucks. Hey, Erica. Hey, Erica. So what we're doing? Oh, hey, Shelly. So what we're doing today, ladies, is we're flipping through some coloring books and we're looking at the inspired room. I flipped through several books already. Oh, well, welcome to the coloring world, Shelly. You're going to have an awesome time. We're all very nice. We all get a little goofy at times, but we're all very nice and supportive. And um, any questions you have, I think we have plenty of people here that can answer them. Oh, Ollie, you used to work at, at Barnes and Noble. Did they did they give you a discount? Like, do they give the workers discounts? And 
you bought two more from Walmart. <laughs> um, just trying to keep up with the comments here. Um, yeah, I'm going to have to get the Crayola Escapes. I guess I'm going to have to break down and get them because I don't have them. So how are, you, how are you, Erica, and how are you, Shelly? So just looking at the comments here. Um, oh, the, the pigment is just inconsistent and the... Um, And, and more and more pigmented than others. Yeah, uh, oh, the are you talking about the craze the craze arts color roux? You know what, Shelly? It doesn't take you very long to get addicted. It does not take you long at all. Oh, I, I bet you did, Ollie. Oh my gosh! Like especially if they give you discounts, I bet you did. I'd never take home any money if I worked at Barnes and Noble. Let me tell you. <laughs> Ollie. <laughs> Ew, summer cleaning. Ew. Yeah, you know what? I did that. I did some of that last week. Oh, Sophie. Oh, no. Oh, and, and you hate to think what she'd do when you start driving the bus again. Oh, my gosh, Kenneth. I bet she is so cute. Yeah, I hate it when a set of pencils isn't consistent like that, color Roo. I guess I know that they're, they're really inexpensive. I don't know. I'm going to have to, I guess because they're so inexpensive, I'm going to, I'm, I'm probably just going to, like, um, I'll probably pick up a set and see how they do. Oh, there you go, Katrina. Um, every day you wake up, it's a great day, and, and you're grateful. That's that's awesome. That's so, that, that is so true, Katrina. Like Deb says, that is so true. Oh, yeah, the, the... Are you talking about Spectrum Noir, Katrina, or Craze Art? Oh, oh, Kenneth, <laughs> cute. Oh yeah, yeah, for for uh, yeah, exactly for uh, for five dollars, they are worth the try. Color Roo. Yes, Kenneth. She does sound like, yeah, Robin says she sounds like a sweet little thing. Oh, she, yeah, she, she does sound very, very cute. Um, yes, yes, yes. I am, I am definitely going to be reviewing, blah, 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 if I can spit it out here. Yes, Tanfully, I am definitely going to be reviewing the uh, Crayola markers I got. Absolutely. Absolutely, absolutely. Yes, I am. Um, exactly, Katrina. It doesn't do any good to complain, even if you wanted to, right? <laughs> um, I think she meant like USA. Yeah, I, I think, uh, I, I think she meant USA, Ollie. <clears throat> Um, oh, oh my gosh. Um, Kenneth, it sounds like she's an easy little thing. It sounds like she's a very easy little thing, huh? And your poor mom, though. Yeah, I think I think I think she meant USA. Um Well, that's 
it's true, Robin. Um, <laughs> I, I can, I can just see you just kind of scenting the air, Ollie, you know, you thought it was a new brand of color pencils you had to investigate. I can just see you kind of scenting the air and kind of going, <laughs> fresh meat. <laughs> Stella's with you under the blanket, too. Oh, cute. <laughs> do, do, uh, do Stella and, um, and Sophie play together a lot, Kenneth? Oh, my gosh. My, my boys, like, my boys play constantly. They're always, they're, they're always playing together. It's crazy. Um, exactly, Dusty. We're all getting to know each other and, and forming friends. That's, that's so true. Oh, okay. So Stella's five years old. Um, all right, so that is the Crayola, the the, uh, the the inspired room. Uh, well, we've been on here for about an hour and 45 minutes. Shall we keep going? Does everybody want to keep going? I have plenty more books to flip through. What do you guys think? Oh, Robin has no friends outside of the coloring groups. Oh, that's too bad, Robin. You know what? I Oh, awesome. Everybody wants to continue. Awesome. Awesome. So we'll we'll continue. Um Yeah, this that's not fun, Robin, to, to not have any friends like outside of the of the coloring world. All right. So, we have I don't remember if I showed this one on a stream. This is Kimono Designs from Creative Haven. I don't remember if I showed this one. But uh, this is a Creative Haven, and next month is Creative... Ooh! Holy moly. Next month is a Creative Haven month. So I thought maybe um, if I haven't showed this one yet... Uh, <laughs> Kenneth. <laughs> um Yeah, you know what? <laughs> That's so true, Debs. Uh keep going, but I might run out of books and have to buy new ones. That is so true. I mean, I have plenty of books to show, but that would just give me excuses to get more now, wouldn't it? <laughs> Aw. Kenneth says that Stella will always be his diva. Um, just looking at the comments here. You know what? Like, I have a few friends, like, in the Lions Club and stuff, but, you know, people that I call, like, true, 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 true friends, I mean, I could probably count on one hand. That's, that's true. That's true, Ollie. How, how else are you going to keep your coloring book host status? That's right. <laughs> oh. oh, that's nice, Katrina, that you have, you know, other friends that come and visit you. I have, I have a few, like, in the Lions Club and stuff, and, <clears throat> and uh, you know, we do get out quite a bit busy and stuff but um like uh I don't do a whole lot of entertaining here and um 
um, you know, not that I wouldn't ever go, you know, somewhere to have like a dinner party or anything, but as long as somebody else plans it, hey, I'm good to go because then I don't have to cook. <laughs> I just noticed I was kind of flipping through this thing pretty fast. So let's go back to the beginning and I'll try to flip through it a little bit slower. Yeah, you know what? It, it seems like you find a you find a group on Facebook that you that you have a lot in common with, and um, and you develop those friendships. Um, oh, Victoria says she used to have friends, but when she was diagnosed with the brain condition. Um, Oh, and you had to cancel plans from being sick. They just, they just dropped. Oh my gosh. Yeah. You know what? That's tough. Hmm. Deb says uh, her best friend now lives an hour's flight away. That's, that's tough when you don't get to see each other. Um. Looking at the comments here. Oh, color roo, you don't like talking on the phone. So, um, you know what? Like I had, I had, I had a similar issue like uh, color roo. Um, <clears throat> I had a, I used to have a friend who isn't a friend anymore, and and uh, she dropped me because I didn't, uh, I didn't check in with her fast enough after, after a storm, but. That is another story. Yeah. Um, have video message, but that's, you know what? Um, Skype. Skype is really good, but, you know, again, it's, it's almost kind of like talking on the phone because it's still a voice chat. Yeah, I agree, Ollie. They weren't, they weren't real friend. They weren't true friends. That is for sure. Yeah, the world has has changed when social media came on the scene. That is so true. Yeah, Victoria, I totally agree with Ollie. They weren't true friends. <clears throat> so this book is uh, is a creative haven. That's so true. That's why people color. That's right, Katrina. Yep. You, you, you know what? Over time, you really find out who your friends really are. Um, just keeping up with the comments. Oh, Shelly, um, Try to hit the, the gear. Um, there's a gear icon like on your video and change the video quality and see if that helps. No, Debs, it's it's not the same, you know, because you can't have that you can't have that cup of coffee together or anything. Um I know. I you know what? I'm I'm totally addicted to the streams. I know. I, same here, Victoria. It's you know what? That's what I like about the streams is you can look at stuff and you can chat together as well. Hey, Camry, how are you? How how are you? Oh no. Yeah. Um, try to, try to change the, uh, try to ch hit the gear guy here. Oh, if I can spit it out, hit the gear icon and change the video quality and see if that helps. So how are you Camry? Um, Um, 
doing good here, Camry. Just, uh, it's been very, very humid. So on my streams, you're going to see that I do a lot of coloring book flips. And right now we're looking at kimono, de uh, kimono designs from Creative Haven. Yeah, I, I know color. I'm the same way. I'm the same way. Like, I'm not one that, like, after I hear about something, like, I'm not one that's gonna, you know, be the, the first one to text or send a message. You know, I'm, I'm the type that I'll kind of give you your space, you know, after something like that happens. And then I'll check in, like, then, you know, you message me, like, when you're feeling like messaging me or something. And some people don't get that. Oh, okay, Kay. We'll, um, we'll call you Kay. Yep. Yeah, same here, Debs. Uh... Oh, um, Kenneth says, um, I only watch, I only watch, uh, four or five streams. Um, I watched one the other day and I thought, uh, she was outspoken, uh, kind of belittling, um, didn't stay long, just didn't, fe didn't feel welcome in her group. That's too bad. Well, you know, we all love you over here, Kenneth. <laughs> you know, we all love you over here. Um, oh, um, Shelly wants to know what being an Amazon affiliate means. Well, um, <clears throat> it means that, um, how, how to explain it. Um, you have, you have like links, like if you're an Amazon affiliate, like you have links or you have like a, an, like an Amazon influencer store. And if you share those links and stuff and, and it, it's kind of like a referral thing. Like if, if you share links and, and people, like if people purchase items or anything things that you provide, it just kind of gives you like a, um, you know, just a little tiny little, little commission, um, back. Like it kind of, it, it kind of helps you, um, not really be a competitor or anything, but it just, it kind of helps you be able to make a little bit of money. Like if you have a blog and like, if you're trying to, like, if you're advertising a book or something, you can give a link, you know, for people to purchase that book. It's a quick link. And when people get stuff through your links or whatever, then, then you make like a little bit of, of money. It's kind of like a thank you from Amazon for, um, advertising products for them, basically. Yes, Kenneth is a sweetheart. That's so true. So I hope I explained it. Okay, Shelly. Um, I, I, you know, did I explain it? enough so hopefully you know hopefully hopefully i explained it well enough exactly you know um that's why we do have so many choices die you can click and go find out what you uh what you like yep and you can you can definitely go find what you like and um you know find a place that you feel very welcomed at and I'm glad you, and I'm glad you join us over here. Yeah, you know what, like, unfortunately there's people out there like that color Aru. Oh, um, Robin can't link this color, link is too long, um. Mm, okay, I'm going to see if I can put a link to this one in there. Um, you know what, Katrina, um, you, you, you definitely make a strong point there. Um, my friend Brenda, like we've known each other for 25 years and, and, uh, you know, she'll, she'll always be my, you know, she'll, she'll always be, uh, she'll, she'll definitely always be a, a sister to me.
Yeah, sorry that happened to you, Kenneth. Uh... Yeah, that's too bad, Kenneth. Oh my gosh. To a couple of my childhood friends over Facebook, but that's that's really about it. Yeah, you know it can be hard to join in this in an existing group. Hey, Arion. I'm not sure if I sa said your name right. How are you? Yeah, you know what? Like, I used to feel guilty about unsubbing from something, too. But, you know, you got to do what you got to do. And if you're not happy, you know, if you're not happy there, then, and if you know you're not going to watch the video, then just to unsub and be done with it. Um. Oh, no, Kay isn't going to be able to buy anything from Amazon. Oh, no. Oh, so I guess you don't get Prime Day in, in Australia then. Uh, just keeping up with the comments. So I'm going to try to find a link to Kimono Designs. Just give me a sec and I'll try to put that in here for you guys. So just give me a second. Go ahead and chat amongst yourselves while I'm doing this. And... Let me just, let me just see here. Kimono Designs. Let's see what we got. My internet's being a little bit slow, so just give me a sec. It's taking a million years for this page to load. I can keep flipping while it's while it's um, while it's being loaded. All right, here we go. So let me look at the okay Japanese kimono designs. Let me just I'm just making sure I have the right book. Uh, I should have typed in Creative Haven. Hmm. Give me a sec. Yikes. Go ahead and keep chatting while I'm looking this up. I'm not on my comments page, so I'm sorry I'm not answering anybody just yet. Trying to find a link for this book. Okay, here we go. So right now it is selling for, I can tell you it is selling for $5.99 on Amazon. And let me grab a link for you guys. Come on. All right. So here comes the, now this is, this is going to be a link um, from, um, the uh, Amazon affiliate link. So here is here here it comes. Okay, there it is. Okay, so just looking and seeing what we have here. Oh, um, your prime day ended last night, Kay. Let's try to get up here so I can see. So your prime day ended last night um, at midnight. But you can't get any good coloring books or, or supplies. Oh, no, it's three times more expensive? That's, oh. Oh, that sucks. 
yeah we didn't have any coloring deals over here either for prime day so you know you really you, you really didn't miss much um oh um <laughs> victoria somebody from high school that you, that didn't like you kept sending you friend requests on facebook you know what that's you know what like i had a um, I had a friend that, that was, uh, on a writing group with me and she was talking about how, uh, you know, people that hated her back in high school and, and who she hated now, now they're wanting to be friends on Facebook. And she found that kind of funny. Oh no. Oh, the, they, they blocked you from, from buying anything other than Australia stuff. Okay. Oh my gosh. I'm just moving the book a little bit because I don't think we were in frame. Oh my gosh, Kenneth. <laughs> Toilet paper and baby stuff. Aw, Holly says, I love this channel. Um, I feel very comfortable. Oh, I'm so glad, Holly. Thank you so much. That 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 really makes me feel good. You know what? That that's true, Victoria. That you know that that they want to do that. Um, <clears throat> you know, just to be nosy. That's true. Um. Oh yeah, um, Dee Dee likes um, Katrina likes Dee Dee. Oh, Christmas presents. Uh, just keeping up with the comments here. Um, Arian says uh, they couldn't. They couldn't be bothered adding the 10% get the order. So we, we, okay. Yeah, I guess, I guess we're still talking about, I guess uh, everybody's still talking about Amazon. I'm just trying to figure out like what I missed when I was getting the link. Uh, oh, um, Kenneth, uh, Oh, right. Yeah. Uh, class reunions. And, and why would you, why would you waste the time to say hi? Um, I know, right, Kenneth? Uh, I know, I know, right? Yeah, I totally know what you mean. You know what? That, that is so true, Color Aru, about some having selective memory. I totally agree. You know what, like, um, I was picked on because of my eyesight, and now, you know, those ones that picked on me, you know, wanted to be friends on Facebook. <laughs> Aw, thank you, Ollie, for subscribing and giving the thumbs up. Thank you so much. Yeah. Victoria um you know what I mean it's kids can be cruel you know because I, I was always picked on for my bad eyesight and stuff and and uh you know what you you never forget about that kind of stuff you just you don't oh you guys are gonna end up getting me to sing coal miner's daughter on the next stream you guys Oh, God, I used to sing that song all the time when I was a kid. <laughs> yeah, just keeping up with the comments. We're just about done with this book. Yeah, have you, have you guys ever heard of the song Coal Miner's Daughter by Loretta Lynn? I used to sing that all the time.
I agree, Katrina. Um, about yeah, positive people. I like positive people too. I agree. Oh, Victoria says she loves that song. Um, my dad, her dad worked uh, 16 years in the mine. Oh, and passed in 2012 from black lung. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Victoria. Yeah, I, I, I do too. I love that song too. I used to sing that thing all the time when I was a kid. Oh, okay. Uh, Mona has heard that song before. Um, Oh, wow, Victoria. So that, that song definitely sounds like your family then, huh? Um. Oh, no. I'm sorry to hear that, Kay. You know, about you guys being bullied and, and your sister's legs and stuff. That's That's too bad. Yes, that will definitely have to be my next beep beep song, Ollie. <laughs> for sure, for sure, for sure. Yeah, that's that's a heck of a big family, Victoria. Oh, uh, Kay hasn't heard that song. It's an old country song from like uh, the 60s, I, 50s or 60s, I think. Aw, thank you so much, Kenneth. That's, you know what? That's so true. And I always believe that where a door closes, another one opens. And and you should concentrate on the things that you do have and not what you don't have. Totally agree. Yep. And thank you so much, Kenneth. Kids are cruel. Kids are definitely cruel, Arion. Um... Victoria says that she's the youngest. Yeah, yeah, t uh, totally color a roo, totally. Oh my, um, eight kids in a three bedroom house. Oh my gosh. Well, you know what? I bet you guys found a way to make it work though. Oh my gosh, Ollie, your mom has 11 kids? Holy smoke. Yeah, my dad had uh, seven brothers and sisters, so they had eight kids. Katrina's right. The brothers and sisters are your best friends. Very true. Oh, okay. Um, Kay says her mom and dad loved all country music. That's awesome. So, yeah, I have two sisters from, um, I have, I have two sisters from, uh, mom and dad's marriage. And then my dad was married once before, um, he married my mom. And so I have, uh, I have two half brothers and a half sister, but my half sister died a few years ago. So, um, I have, I have two sisters and, and two brothers. All right, so let's see what, shall we keep going, everybody? Shall we keep going? We could look at some Art Nouveau fashions. Shall we keep going, everybody? Um, just keeping up with the comments. <laughs> Victoria! <laughs> All right, everybody wants to continue. So we have Art Nouveau Fashions. This is also from Creative Haven. So I figured once we get a little bit closer to Creative Haven Month, we can look at some more Creative Haven books to kind of give us, uh, to get us quite a bit prepared, because that's going to be coming up in August. 
So in case you guys didn't know, I am helping out um, myself and um, A Colorful Life and Grace's Coloring Corner are co-hosting the Creative Haven Month in August. <coughs> oh, Ollie's liking this book already. That's awesome. Yeah, this is a pretty book. Um, Kay has three sisters that she grew up with and, and a half-sister who is 16 this year. Oh, she was raised as an only child and, and, and has been spoiled. Oh. Sadly, that happens. Oh, Robin put up a link for this book. Thank you, Robin. <coughs> Thanks so much, Robin. So I have many, many, many fashion books from Creative Haven. If you like, I can do a whole stream devoted to the, the fashion books if you all like. Oh, okay. Kay was looking at getting this book. Oh, that's cool, Mona. Um, two brothers and a sister. Yep, I know what you mean, Katrina. Oh, okay. Uh, let's see. Just keeping up with the comments. Okay. Um, oh, yeah. Um, Prisma. Yeah, definitely. Pr Prismas would go very, very well in this book, Ollie. And I like Prismas on this paper. Definitely like Prismas on this paper. Oh, Katrina's sisters are feeling bad because she's going to be the first to be a grandma. Um, and she's the youngest one. So congratulations, Katrina. Oh, oh my gosh, Kay. Asking for a gift that's like 350 bucks. Oh my gosh. Are Prismas real expensive in Australia, Kay? Oh my gosh, that, that is very, yes, that is very spoiled. Totally agree, that is very spoiled. You have zero Creative Haven books, Victoria? What's so wrong with you, my friend? <laughs> We're going to have to remedy that. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. That is crazy, Kay. Oh man. So she uh, Kay says that Prismas are 270 at the highest. Oh my gosh, Kay. Yeah, oh. Uh, I know. I know, right, Victoria? Oh my gosh. Yeah, we're we're going to have to remedy that. And you know what? Like the the Creative Haven books really are not that expensive at all. You can get um, I've seen them as, as like, well, you can get Dover ones, which are the same publisher, but it's kind of a different book format, but the Dover ones are like two and three bucks, maybe four. And then the creative, ha the creative Haven ones are around six. So, you know, these are the kind of books that aren't going to break the bank and you can find subject matter for just about any subject. Oh yeah. I think, I think you'll really like them, Victoria. And you know, and there's there's so many books like you can find a book for every kind of interest with creative haven um oh okay so okay you you got a set when they were on sale 150 a set um oh your best friend got them for oh my gosh that's awesome 
How do you like them? <laughs> Ollie. <laughs> yep, yep. That's that's what I would do, Ollie. Yes, they do have very nice prices, Victoria. Oh, okay, Shelly. Well, thank you so much for popping in. And uh, come back anytime. I stream on Tuesdays and Thursdays at noon Central Time. So come back anytime. Hi, Susan. Come back anytime and join us. And I'm so glad you enjoyed it here with us today. How are you, Susan? Um, oh, the paper is too thin on your Dover book? Hey, Sharon. Mm -hmm. Oh, Sharon says she has 30 Creative Haven books and she loves them. Yeah, they are very nice, aren't they? Bye, Shelly. Take care. So, Sharon, what we do on my streams, I know this is probably the first time you've been to one of my streams, um, we look at, we just do some coloring book flip-throughs and we're looking at um, Art Nouveau fashions from Creative Haven. Doing good here, Susan. Um, it's been just, we've had a, we've had a heat wave here and uh, so we've been just sitting inside with our air. We have central air, thank goodness. Um, oh, um, African people, that was African Glamour from Creative Haven, Katrina. That was called African Glamour. Yep, yeah, we, we do, we do look at flip throughs and talk a lot, don't we, Color Aru? That is so true. So, so true. So I do flip throughs on my streams, Sharon, because um, I have bad eyesight, so I can't really color on stream and keep up with the chat. Uh, oh, okay. Can um, Oh, you can see the pictures on the back of the page. Um, you're getting some more Creative Haven coloring books. That's too bad about your Dover book, though, because um, normally, normally it's not like that. I wonder if you got it. I wonder if you got some with some bad paper or something. See you, Kay. Have a good one. Thanks so much for joining us. Oh, good. I'm, I'm glad you like this book, Susan, the Art Nouveau Fashion. I'm glad you like this book. This is a nice book. Oh, um, Kay's twin actually got her into coloring. That's awesome. Oh, your tw you you think you you said your twin watches me? Wow, small world. That's awesome. That's awesome. Awesome. Yeah, you know. Um, I think some of the Dover books are meant to be kids' books because they're they're quite a bit simpler than like uh, the the Creative Haven ones. Although sometimes you can find some pretty detailed ones, but yeah, I think those books they they're kind of meant more for kids. But I've seen so many adults enjoying them too. Yes, this book is pretty, isn't it, Victoria? <coughs> um. <laughs> Ollie. <laughs> How do we know Kay isn't the twin? <laughs> If 
I've seen her around Queen Anna. That's pretty though. That's pretty. I know that is funny. <laughs> um, yeah. Um, I think I, ha I think I have that book actually. Okay. I think I have that goddess book. Because it's, it's a double-sided book, and it's got um, it's got a blurb about each goddess, like, underneath of it. Yeah, I think I have that book. Because a lot of the Dover books, it will have a little blurb under each page, like, talking about what the design is and stuff. Like, a little bit of information. <laughs> Kay says that she's the nice twin. <laughs> Yeah, I, yeah, I think I know exactly what book you're referring to, Kay. <clears throat> I'll have to look at that one and see if I can see the the picture on the reverse side of the page because I never noticed it. I never noticed my book doing that. So we are almost to the end of this book. And hopefully everybody's internet is acting okay. Ugh. Just uh, adjusting my chair just a little bit. Uh, just looking at the chat. Oh, okay. I'll have to do that, Kay. I'll have to hold it up and see if I can see through it. I'll have to do that. I know the Creative Haven paper is, is quite a bit better. Hi, Jen. How are you? Jen has just joined us. So what we are doing today is more coloring book flips, and we're just finishing up with Art Nouveau Fashions. Oh, right. <laughs> Don't jinx it, Deb, right? <laughs> oh, no. Ollie says every time, every time you type it buffers. Oh, man. That sucks. Um, yeah, this, this is a very cute book, Jen. Um, you really can't go wrong with the Creative Haven book. You really can't. So we are at the end of this book and we get an example of a picture here of how it looks colored in. So I think we have time for one more book. My gosh, we've been at this for like two and a half hours. Holy smoke, you guys. Time really flies when you're having fun, doesn't it? Time really flies when we're having fun. So how about we look at, um, now this is definitely geared for the United States because this is fashions of the first ladies. So these are like the, what the wives of the, of the U.S. presidents would wear. And this was like over time. This is a Dover publications book. This is a Dover book. Uh, let's see. Just looking at the comments here. Um, what is the, Katrina wants to know what the, oh, um, what is the name of the, of the African book again? Let me, let me type it in for you, Katrina. It's African Glamour. Let me just, let me type it in for you. African Glamour. Okay. There's, 
there you go, Katrina. Um, I typed it in for you. It's African Glamour. Oh, Robin put the link for the book here. Thanks so much, Robin. Um, oh, okay. Uh, it's, it's 428 where you are, Kay. Um, yeah, I live stream, um, Tuesdays and Thursdays at noon, um, central, like central time in the U S on Tuesdays and Thursdays, which I don't know. Uh, oh, thank you, Katrina. She's telling everybody to give me a thumbs up. Thank you so much. Yeah. I don't know what that time would be in, in Australia. Kay. Um, let's see. So 428, it'd probably be what? Two o'clock. I think your time. Okay. Cause we've been on here for about two and a half hours. Thank you, everybody. Yeah, okay. This is a really pretty book. This is such a pretty, pretty book. We're just trying to get it where hopefully everything is in frame. Okay, Wednesday morning. Yeah, that's right, because you guys are way, way ahead of us in time. What part of Australia are you from? Well, thank you, Robin. We sure appreciate the links. Oh, Ollie. Um, I, to I totally understand. Um, but thank you so much for joining us. Um, thank you so much for joining us. Sorry you were buffering so bad. Um, come back again. I do this every Tuesday and Thursday. You have a good day, Ollie. Okay, you're in Queensland. Kay is in Queensland. Um, yeah, kimono designs from earlier. Okay, thanks so much, Robin. Take care, Ollie. Oh, you were born in Tasmania and love the cold weather? Well, you can sure have our cold weather that we get over here because I hate it. <laughs> And Ariana's in Victoria. I've been to Australia twice, guys. I've been to Australia twice, and I'd love to come back. Yep, see you next stream, Ollie. Feel free to come back anytime. Well, I do this every Tuesday and Thursday. I don't think I'm I don't think this whole thing is in frame. Let me see if I can get this whole thing in frame. All right, guys, we're going to go back to the beginning of this book because I did not get everything in frame here. All right. So let's just let's just quickly go back to the beginning. I didn't get very far, but I just didn't like that everything wasn't in frame. So we'll just kind of quickly go back. Oh, OK, your daylight savings time hasn't started yet. Oh, okay. Your name is Linda. Okay. Okay. I will make a note of that and I will call you Linda. Hey, Michelle. Okay. So you are Linda. Hi, Michelle. How are you? Yeah. It, daylight savings time has started here. Yeah, I know, Katrina. You were really loving that African book. Did you find it? Were you able to find it? Cause I I know you were really, you you were really liking that book. Oh, Case Wynn lives in South uh, South Australia. Oh, and half a half an hour before and a half an hour back. That's got to get kind of confusing, huh? You know, with that half an hour thing here. Oh, okay. Linda says it's uh, it's five thirty four in Victoria. Yeah, I always thought it was kind of um, neat, you know, that that your that you your guys' seasons are are you know 
on the opposite of ours because like you get like it, Christmas time you guys are right in the middle of your summer and uh, we're lucky if we don't have like 10 inches of snow on the ground <laughs> Um, yeah, Robin was providing us links. Yeah, I bet it is, you know, that half an hour thing. Oh, send, uh, send Victoria some cold. <laughs> you know what? I, I think you're going to be begging for, I think you're going to be begging for heat by the time December rolls around, Victoria. <laughs> I know I will be. Um, yeah, it's, it's very hot over here too, Katrina. We're not very far from you though. Oh, wow. Wow. That, that sounds, that sounds like a very, very warm Christmas there, Kay. Oh, th three degrees where you are, Linda. Yeah, you guys, you guys are in the middle of your winter now, aren't you? Oh my gosh, Victoria has the. Oh my gosh, Victoria has the fan on in winter and the window open. Oh man. Oh man, I hate cold weather. Absolutely hate cold weather. Katrina has that old Moroccan hospitality. That's awesome. Well, we're going to have to get together, girl, because, like, uh, you know, we're not very far away from each other. <laughs> Victoria's a furnace. <laughs> is a furnace that's funny can everybody see this okay i kind of felt like some of this wasn't in frame well victoria if you come if you come to illinois let me know and and we can all get together Um, oh, Katrina loves birds. Oh, good, good. I'm, I'm glad you can see it. Okay, Linda. I, I just felt like it, I just felt like I was cutting some of it off and it wasn't all in frame. Katrina also likes teddy bears. Teddy bears, Katrina. <laughs> oh, sounds good, Victoria. Yeah, definitely let us know if you're going to be coming this way. <clears throat> Alicia says she loves dogs. Me too. Me too. I love dogs. Oh, okay. Color Roo says it won't start to get cold there till around November. Um, okay. Katrina's um, talking about her kids and being half Moroccan. Oh, that would, yeah, that would be awesome if the whole community could meet up, wouldn't it, wouldn't it, Debs? That would be awesome. Oh my gosh, um, Kay has a canary that's around 15 years old. Wow, that's awesome. They, they can live to be quite, um, they can live for quite a long time, can't they? Uh-oh, something, oh no, um, something went wrong. Uh, oh, 
okay, good. Um, oh, good. I'm glad I'm back, Mona. Um, yeah, I, di I didn't know if I was, um, because everything looked okay here, but I guess you must have been buffering or something. Oh, Victoria misses the 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 windows at Christmas. Yeah, those are pretty, aren't they? Oh, Linda has two cockatoos. You know what? It seems like the it seems like the weather is really making everybody's internet act up. Oh, okay. Um, Kay says that the can canaries live to be normally ten to twelve years old. Well then, your your canary is quite old for a for a for a bird like that. Then. Oh, and the food, yeah. <laughs> Alicia has two dogs. What kind are they, Alicia? Yeah, the heat. Yeah, the heat can definitely make the internet act up. I think. Um, yeah, they really are beautiful dresses, aren't they, Katrina? Um. Oh, no, Katrina, you messed up your dress shop in Romantic Country and can't color dresses anymore? Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, your winter got really cold, color a -roo? Um, oh, and you lived in Boston. Yeah, you know what? Um, I wouldn't miss the, the snow or the freezing temperatures either. Oh, Alicia has a pug and a Shih Tzu. Aw, cute. I have two golden retrievers. Oh, Michelle, and Michelle was talking about her dog. She has two little dogs. Jazzy is about... 12 years old and Abby is around four. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, Mona, you take it easy. Thank you so much, Mona. I'm so glad you enjoy my streams. You take care. Oh, um, I, I bet it makes it real cozy having a fireplace, doesn't it, Kay? I, I bet it makes it real cozy having a fireplace. You take care, Mona. Have a nice day, and thanks so much for coming, as always. I'll do this again on Thursday. So I know I'm going to be coloring quite a bit in this book. I really like this book. Yeah, you have a nice day too, Mona. And we are at the end of this book. And so I think, um, let's see, there's a, there's some inspiration on how you can color some of the dresses right there. Here's the back of the book. So I think I'm going to call it a day and I think I'm going to go ahead and end the stream here. We've been on for holy smoke, almost three hours, two hours and like almost 45 minutes. So I think I'm going to go ahead and sign off and I just want to thank everybody for coming. Oh gosh, Katrina, you bought two more and didn't want to mess them up. Oh my gosh. Um, Alicia, I don't color on my streams because I have I have the the bad eyesight and I can't color and keep up with the chat. So I just do coloring book flip throughs on my streams. I don't color on my streams. But I think I'm gonna go ahead and end things here. So I will say bye to everyone. Uh, you are so welcome, Debs. Thank you so much. You're so welcome, Di. 
Um, awesome. I'm so glad you enjoyed yourself, Dusty. Thanks so much, everybody. Thank you. Thank you so much, everybody. All right. Talk to you. Talk to you all later. We'll see you Thursday. If you want to uh, come to the stream on Thursday, I'll be on at the same time in the same place on Thursday. We'll do this again. All right. Bye, everybody.